What's up, everyone? It's Grandma Rebecca here. So, well, it's my grandpa. So, going on a little train spotting uh, with some other stuff in it too. So, it's uh, for a date and time. Saturday, February 11th, 2017. So, um, first thing we're doing is going to the new QT that just opened about a week ago, and we're gonna see what it looks like. It should be pretty big, so it's gonna be really warm today. It's gonna be like almost 70 degrees, very unusual. I mean, it's kind of a cloudy day, but it's not supposed to rain, so it's good. So, yep, and there it is. It's right up there. I, I could actually almost walk to it, but it would be a little bit of a walk. Yeah, it'd be a walk, yeah. There it is. Yeah. This one has a kitchen in it. Yeah. Watch the old one, there was no The room. kitchen, it has like pizza and pretzels, yeah. ice Sandwiches, cream, yeah. Even some breakfast stuff. Breakfast stuff, yeah. Here we go pulling into it. We had to wait at that intersection for quite a long time, but whatever. And we'll just pull up right here. Yeah. Yeah, they got breakfast pizza. Holy cow. Yep, let's get a breakfast pizza and take it with us on the road. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so here's what it looks like. Got the hot dog. There's the Sunny D that I love. That is so good. Hurt my feelings. Alright, so we're leaving the new QT. Um, my first look at it, I thought it was really nice. What do you think? Yeah, very impressive. And yeah. I'm also building a new Popeyes restaurant right there. John, I actually don't think I've ever been to a Popeyes before. So, And they also just built a new Arby's. Um, and this opened February 2nd, so, let's see, about nine days ago, so, yeah. Let's see, what does it say? If it, when do you think the Popeyes will open? Um, well, they should have opened about by now, but they're running behind schedule, so maybe March. Yeah. Sometime in March, I'll bet. Oh, and he got Sunny D. Yeah. What flavor? Blue? The blue. It's the blue raz. Yum, yum. And I got Mountain Dew Pitch Black. And this big jumbo honey bun. Alright, we're going by another railroad yard. That's not the one that we're going to. We're on uh, Interstate 44. It's 1009 and we're coming very close to downtown St. Louis. And we will be also be going to this park right across the river in East St. Louis, so that should be pretty neat. And they're also doing construction of the arch. They've been doing that for a long time, for months. And it should be done really soon, so yeah. It's getting really warm already. It's 62 right now. Oh yeah, I yep. see it right there. Yep. So, we've been enjoying this so far. So, I think we'll be able to see. Wherever coming up, we're in. We're coming up to downtown St. Louis. Should we be able to see Bush Stadium? Scott Trade Center. Yeah. And then the guy said you have to buy a ticket right. for that. And that yeah. hurt our you see the Scott Trade Center? Yeah. They're going to. Oh, there's people waiting to get in for something. Huh. Huh. 
It's not a blues game. Blues are, yeah, you know where they're. They're on the road, aren't they? Montreal. Oh. Uh, all right, we're going to Illinois. See much train traffic down there today. Keeping my fingers crossed for the railroad yard in East St. Louis. Yeah. Hope we get to see some trains there today. Work zone. Slow down. Except I don't see any workers. Where's the workers? to the left. There's the arch. Yeah, look. Oh, look, the grounds. Look at all the grass and stuff. April the 8th, they're supposed to have some kind of a grand opening there. Yeah, should go to it. Yeah. Whatever the, day, the week that is. So and here we are crossing the Mississippi River. Quarter mile. Use the right three lanes to take exit one for Illinois three south for Cahokia. Uh -huh. Oh yeah. Then on Illinois three south. Remember our great road trip to Cahokia and Dupo? Yeah. We saw the 